Hello, my name is Peter Riffew. Uh, I'm a professor in the Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering Department at the University of Florida. Um, this is the Archer Aviation Laboratory. In this lab, we do all kinds of prototyping of vehicles uh, for all kinds of things. And I've been working here since 1993, so that's 30 years, actually. I love this department. It's a great lab, and I have a really energetic group of students. So my philosophy when it comes to doing research is I want to tackle some of the big problems. I want to change the world. I have two groups of research. One is in experimental stress analysis and composite materials, and then another one is in autonomous vehicles. Our autonomous vehicles uh, operate in the water, uh, in the sky, and some of them actually operate in the water and sky. So I'll give you an example. We're developing the system called the Bathydrome, which is a, a vessel that's got sonar on it, there's a tether to a big drone, and the drone drags the vessel on the water and then does bathymetry, which is underwater survey and mapping. Another thing that I'm working on is developing systems for managing fires, wildfires. And so we're developing autonomous systems to mitigate fires, to put out fires, even in dense forests. So my drone lab's a little different than most drone labs, in a sense that most labs buy off-the-shelf components and then work on the autonomy and making things fly and doing certain tasks. We start from scratch. We build all our aircraft from scratch. And that gives us a lot of power to, to develop some really unique capabilities of these aircraft. For instance, we have a, a drone that's 20 pounds and lifts 20 pounds. With that drone, we can drag a vessel on the surface to do sonar. We could also collect water with this thing we call the sipper. And so this lowers down to the water surface, collects water for some of the pressing issues we have in Florida, like algal blooms and red tide. So these are very challenging things that are difficult to do with boats, but we could do them with drones. So we can literally pull up to the side of the road, send a drone out half a mile offshore, collect a water sample and bring it back in minutes. So this is the Archer Aviation Laboratory. It's named after a company called Archer Aviation. It was donated to us about three years ago, so in about 2021. Um, it is dedicated to developing electric vertical takeoff and landing urban air mobility platforms, air taxis, basically electric flying taxis. Um, Archer Aviation was actually named after my lab on Archer Road, Florida. Now Archer Aviation is in the Silicon Valley. The first seven employees were my students. Uh, they have 700 employees now. They have billions of dollars worth of contracts from United Airlines, from the United Arab Emirates, from India, uh, NASA, and the Air Force. So in this laboratory, we built the first three or four prototypes for Archer Aviation, culminating in a 10 foot by 10 foot, 260 pound, 12 ducted fan version of the aircraft that's hanging from our ceiling now. So if you want to learn more about Archer Aviation, check their website. If you want to learn more about my lab, check the MAE website.